Here we are at Gladys and Samuels, and I'm in the kitchen with Mama Amy, and she's from Oaxaca, and she is the queen of tamales. So she is so gracious to show us how she's going to make these beautiful tamales, so let's get started. When Ricky and I were invited to Gladys's house for dinner and to learn how to make tamales from her mother, we were of course so excited. Ricky and I have both been raised that when you're invited to someone's house for a meal, that you go with a healthy appetite, that it would be bad manners to arrive not hungry. As we began to watch Mama Amy prepare the tamales, one of the first questions that she asked us was, are you hungry? Ricky and I have proudly shared with her that yes, we were starving. Ooh, wrong answer. So it was explained to us that by arriving hungry, our hungry energy would go into the tamales and that they would either not be good or the tamales would take a very, very long time to cook. <laughs> so we were quickly sat down at the dining room table to eat some delicious tiangas de pollo. So Gladys put a bit of this tiangas de pollo on a tostada, which is like a crunchy shell. And, um, the chipotle makes it a little spicy, but I, I can handle it. It's, um, let's see here. Mm. Muy rico. Totally delicious. Everybody needs a Mama Emmy. This is the, the thing that we're gonna put inside to the corn, mm -hmm. or the masa. This is the masa. This is a... Mmm, muy rico. It's... <laughs> Chicken, tomatoes, uh, onions, onions, and chili. Chili. Yeah, but that, it's not super spicy. No, it's not super. It does depend how spicy do you want. You can add more chili, but we don't put a lot just for eating like a normal. And then, um, how does your mama make the maize? Here in Puerto, it's easy because just only in the tortilla in the tortilleria. Just we get it, just ask for masa. You get it just like that there? Yeah, oh. like this. And the only thing that she uh, add was uh, was the salt. Can I put it? Do you want to try it a little bit? Yes. Yeah. Oh. This is also we, uh, we give uh, to the hmm. kitchen when they uh, in life, just for a snack. Mm -hmm. And then in Oaxaca, would your mommy make it homemade? The, the maize? Yeah, well, you need to uh, boil in the water, pour the corn, do all the process for the corn, and then uh, she go in one specific local for printer the mask. A lot of work. Yeah, wow. it's more. It is easier. <laughs> You're going to fall off and shake. You're going to do you want to try it? The, to eat the banana leaf? No, just to uh, oh, really? like this one. I don't está roto ya se jala. Just when it's like right here? Yeah. Aquí? Aquí. Aquí. Oh, with that. And then down here? Yeah. All along the stem. I don't want to wreck it. Yeah. Oh. That's it. Se so cuida su vestido porque mancha. Just watch your dress it. Oh, si. Sí. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mama, here? Aquí? Mire así. Se jala. Se mire así. One hand. Ajá, así porque su mano ha de estar grande. Entonces así. Did she say my hand is large? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so do you, are you a little Yo así, mire, hand. yo sí. así, así. El mío. Pero But in your case, no, we just want. Closed hand. Yeah. But in mama's case, it's an open hand. Okay, entiendo. Sí. Claro, gracias. Okay. This is fun. Okay, so one closed hand. No, here. Start here. Hey, here, just here. Okay. Just down. Do, 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 do. That's gonna be a small tamale. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh jeez. Oh no. No, <laughs> mire, así. Oh, no, Cheeto. <laughs> Lo siento. Look at it. Oh no. It's difficile. Uh, the mama makes it look easy. It's not easy. <laughs> Yes, it comes. Ah. She does it like butter. 
Yes, it does. Now you can. This yes, is one. Um, this is one, right? Or yeah. I feel shaky. I'm nervous. I don't want to wreck the moment. No, it's okay. Oh no. Yeah, much okay. better. That's better. See? Yeah. Amy is using this Mexican press here <laughs> and she's squishing down. Oh, you really have to squish it. Wow. The maize to make the shell of the tamale. She's putting in a scoop of her delicious filling. And Ricky and I have tried this and this tamale has changed our life. We've been kind of obsessed with tamales. And then we tried Mama Amy's tamales, and it's like, whoa, the queen of tamale. Okay, so the leaf is on like a little blend of Look at that, pure perfection. I'm just tucking it in with love. All that yummy Oaxacan good. So this is the big steamer that the mama's gonna cook the tamales in. And there's a little baby steamer. Yeah. Um, but uh, the mama's going crazy here. There's mucho, mucho tamales to cook. So we got to get the big guns out. Okay. So now I put that on top. Fold it. Push it down. See? And then, okay. Recio. Mas. Mas. Oh, geez, your forte. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Enough. Yeah, ah, see? Yeah, my first tamale crisp. Oh, she said that you are good, so you're grande. Oh, I don't know. That's a lot of pressure. This is hard to push that, eh? Do you want to? It's quite the process, isn't it? Okay. That side always goes first, mm -hmm. the wee side. Primero el delgado. And then Rodi Oatst. Okay. It's like tucking in a baby. And yeah. that's it. Okay. You that's need to it. Do everything she now. makes it look uh, so easy. <laughs> okay, so a little ball. These are all portion sized out already. I'll put this on top. Hold it over. Is that the other one? Is it 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 Little more tomato. Yes. Okay. What a carne. Oh, what a carne. Meat. Meat. That's Eso. mucho. Okay. Bueno, and then I fold it. Mm-hmm. Así. No, right no, over. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there. Eso. Yeah. That's it. Eso. And then the sides. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Como taco. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Ah. It's okay. No, yeah. And then... It goes on the banana leaf. No, no, just wait. No, no, put it there. Yeah, now you don't flip. Let me see. Ah! Hold on, Roy. Okay, this one first. Yes, so. See? And then flip. See? And then tuck it. See? And then tuck it. Oh, yeah. See? <laughs> Pump it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Mine does not look as good as yours. <laughs> no, Benita. Yours are Benita. Okay, Cassie's good. 
So Mama Emmy quickly figured out that Ricky is the better cook out of the two of us and I was kicked out of the kitchen. Ricky invited in and he never left again. Mama Emmy and Ricky just hit it off and Ricky was a cooking machine under Mama Emmy's guidance. Amy has suddenly grown. <laughs> okay, so she is starting to put the tamales in the pan. This is the big pan. Lo tiene que colocar así tiene que venga. Okay, you want to watch? She wants to show you how. Así lo tiene que poner, así, así, así. Y acá uno medio. Para que entre el calor. So she's layering them in a very deliberate and s specific way, and I hear her counting. Este va a ser para probar. Is that the bad one? That's from the herb. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So now we put leaves over the top. Okay, Mama Emmy is covering with more leaves. And there's 31. 32? <coughs> 32. 32 right. tamales yeah. covered it with leaves. Ponemos todo. 32. Ajá, 32. Ahora sí salieron muchos. Ahí está. Ya, mm. como ya está hirviendo, yeah. as it's bo boiling, mm -hmm. that's why that she already put the tamales. Okay. Ah. Ah, ahorita vamos a esperar 40 minutos. Now she said that we will be waiting for 40, 40 minutes. minutes. Well, it's going to be hard to wait. Sí. <laughs> Sadly, Ricky and I were so excited to eat Mama Emmy's tamales, we forgot to film it. Oh no, so this is our only footage. But let me tell you, they were dynamite. Absolutely delicious. That is steaming hot. So Mama Amy was so generous with her time and sharing her tamales. She sent us home with tamales and before she went back to Oaxaca, Ricky and I wanted to reciprocate and have her over to the house. So Ricky here is cooking Irish stew. So usually Ricky makes Irish stew with lamb, but Mama Amy does not like lamb, so he, only for Mama Amy, made it with beef. What is that line? Oh, it's the extractor fan shadow. <laughs> but, uh, oh, I'm excited for them to get here. Seven more minutes. So our three Oaxacan friends, today's amigos de Oaxaca, sí. Sí. Um, sitting here, they're very nervous. Mama's <laughs> drinking her water to get the bravery to try the Irish stew. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes. No, it's good. It's good, Gladys. Okay, here's the match. Dinner has been a hit. Mama Imi thinks the stew is similar to a stew from Mexico City, but not quite as sweet. 
And Ricky's digging out his pots to show off now. <laughs> ah, see? I don't know. Ah, see. Sí. But it's going to cook. use it in the oven because... Este es perfecto para esta comida, we're going to... Oh, sí. well, there you go, Ricky. Tiene otro sabor más delicioso. Is uh, brown para... Sí. Y... Es que es horrible. Ah, pero el horno también bueno. No.